Good evening. Uh, welcome back with us on Facebook Live and on our website there. Uh, time for our presentation for our senior uh, scholarship. Uh, looks like we've got most everybody here. Uh, I've got a list here. We're going to just kind of go down a the list there and do a, a time of presentation. Um, so um, first one we got there is Parker Vaughn. Parker, are you on site here with us? You here, Parker? All right, come on, Parker. Yeah, come on up here. All right, for uh, for your parents and stuff, you're welcome to come up front here and get pictures here, but we'll let you come off on the side and we'll get some additional pictures over there as well. So, Parker, you have won a $1,000 scholarship from Alabama Student Angles Bass Fishing Association. Congratulations, sir. If you don't mind shaking my hand, I don't think I got anything. Uh, so, let me tell you, uh, Parker is... Uh, uh, been fishing with us a while is a uh, great representative of his team uh, and, and uh, the Alabama Student Anglers Bass Fishing Association. It always does our heart, uh, I mentioned this last night, it does my heart good to see, you know, the, the letter of recommendation and, and seeing the accomplishments and then also seeing how, um, you know, you've related stories about how you've been in fishing and tournaments and such as that. Tell me some, uh, some of your favorite fishing moments. Just the ones with my friends, mostly. Just having a good time. That's all I'm having. Uh, you you know, with Hayden, and have had a great team for many years and been uh, extremely competitive. Again, to this tournament here, y'all are sitting in a real good position right now. We'll put that out there in a little bit so you'll see right where everybody is. But uh, y'all have done a great job. So um, who are some of your bigger influences that, that's helped you out in this to, to make you a better fisherman? My boat captains, uh, everybody that's put me up to this point, my friends, everybody that I can learn from. Good deal, good deal, absolutely. Uh, this industry is is only surviving some uh, for the most part by us and our boat captains in it. So if we don't have a good boat captain to put us out there, we're in trouble. So, uh, so that so uh, we uh, appreciate you, and I know you will continue on in uh, in your fishing career and representing us and your team well. Congratulations. Yes, sir. All right, get a picture right here. Make sure you receive it. All right, you can come over here. We'll do some more. Tanner Shelton, come on aboard. Where'd you go, Tanner? Oh, you're coming around the other way. Come on around this side. All right, Tanner, you've been up on this stage many times. Tanner is a, uh, another $1,000 ASA BFA scholarship winner. Congratulations. Um, I don't think that's the only scholarship you've got with us, though, is it? Have you got some um, uh, first, second, third, fourth place finishes with us, big fish? I was thinking maybe you had. Not sure? Okay. Well, I know you represent as well. You, you're always one of the top fishermen, you know, when we have our tournaments. So you guys do a tremendous job. Uh, and just like I was telling uh, him, uh, you represent your team well. Y'all put in the effort and make a, a good uh, – hold on one second. I'm fitting to get a mess back here. <laughs> we got a wet floor and my scholarships were, were dropping on me, so I didn't want to get them messed up. So, uh, real proud of you, uh, Tanner. Tell me, uh, I, I know somebody out there you probably want to thank and stuff for what he's doing for you, but you got a whole bunch of other folks with Hayden in there. Tell me some of the folks that's uh, made a big influence in your life in the world of uh, fishing here. Yes, sir. Uh, been blessed to be part of high school fishing since seventh grade, and uh, it's been a blast. Had a lot of good boat captains throughout the years. Uh, had my dad with me along the way, Jeff Vaughn, right here. And uh, it's been fun. I'm going to miss it. Well, we, we're going to miss seeing you up here. Uh, not everybody's got the flow and hair that you got. <laughs> you get you get harassed every time about that, don't you? Hey, we're very proud of you, Tanner. Good luck and best Thank wishes you. here in your future Thank event you. endeavors. We know you'll do us well. Good job, buddy. 
Next we got Riley Underwood. Are you here yet? Riley, you here? Come on, buddy. I think somebody out there got a bigger smile than you do. <laughs> She's grinning from ear to ear. Yeah. All right, Riley, you're a thousand dollar scholarship winner from ASA BFA. Uh, you know, like with all the scholarships that we're presenting today and yesterday, we got some great sponsors that, that help us out tremendously. Like with Go Build Alabama, Phoenix Boats, um, we got uh, Freedom Marine, a bunch of different you know people that that make a big difference and allow this to go. So we want to thank those that, that have uh, donated to this and to uh, make this possible. So um, tell me about some of your highlights of fishing with Briarwood. So I started out fishing in, I think ninth grade was my first tournament here on Gunnersville actually, and um, since then just progressed and um, won the Pickwick tournament last year and had a pretty good finish last year overall. Yep. Just been really fun. Yeah, y'all did quite well last year. Y'all just dominated the whole from start to finish last year. Y'all had a great uh, 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 tournament team last year with, with ASA Biffay. Very proud of what y'all have done with that. And just like I've been saying with others, I know you're going to do well in representing us as you keep going. Uh, keep the, the sport of fishing alive. Um, very pleased with everything you're doing and accomplishing. Congratulations, buddy. Thank you. All right. Come over here and let's get some more pictures. Next we got Wyatt Murphy. You here? Wyatt. Come on, buddy. Come on up here, buddy. Wyatt Murphy, $1,000 ASA BFA scholarship winner. Uh, very proud of you, buddy. Yeah, down there in my neck of the woods over there in Smith Station, not too far from there. Yes, so tell me about fishing with ASA BFA and Smith Station. Man, I've been fishing with ASA BFA since uh, the beginning of the high school team, since ninth grade, and I've absolutely loved fishing with y'all over these years, man. Yeah, well, we enjoy having you guys with us. Uh, Smith Station and, and several of your uh, teammates there does a lot of uh, posting on uh, Instagram, that kind of stuff, and we appreciate you getting recognized on like that. But uh, most importantly, we like to just see what you guys are doing well, and, and uh, you represent your team well with that, and uh, as well as the rest of your team. Y'all doing a pretty good job on this tournament here. So are you on fish or not? Well, I'm going to be completely honest with you. No, I am not. <laughs> <laughs> well, that happens sometimes. It, uh, but one good thing about this is, is one day to the next can make a huge change. One cast to the next can make a huge change. As I know you know from fishing and stuff uh, with, with us in the past and other tournaments in there. So I'm going to give you the same opportunity. Tell me about some of the highlights of fishing with ASA BFA. Man, every day is a highlight whenever you get to go fishing. But I've had days where you, there's things that you can't even make up, you know. I've seen many, many weird things that only nature keeps hidden and everything, but highlights, I, ju I still just think every day's a highlight whenever you go fishing. Nothing wrong with that. I enjoy that uh, the same way with that there. Just getting a chance to be out there on the water and enjoying nature. You know, sometimes you don't even catch a fish where you want it. That's why you went out there, but just enjoying nature out there is a you know perfect opportunity. Uh, that that's my uh, uh, resting place sometimes. You know, if I just got to get away a little bit and get a little relaxation, catch a fish or not, doesn't matter. Just get a chance to be out there on the water and enjoy this sport. So high school fishing has become obviously uh, huge. So we've been doing this now for 10 years. And, um, you know, where we started, I don't know that the regional people saw just how far this would be going, but I know that in their heart that this was one of the primary things i've talked with some of their initial directors in there and to be able to get these kind of scholarships out there with some great sponsors that we've got is just huge and we just wish you the best here buddy yes sir Thank congratulations you.
some more pictures made over there. Yes, sir. All right, Tucker Smith, come on up. Come on, Tucker. You got everybody in the place rooting for you just to get on stage. All right, Tucker, uh, this Tucker Smith, uh, he is a winner of a uh, Alabama Student Anglers Bass Fishing Association Scholarship for $1,000. So uh, that'll go a little bit to help you out with a little bit of college. Where are you going to college? I'm going to Auburn. You're going to Auburn. Well, uh, I may have to take that money back. I don't know if I want to see that. <laughs> no, congratulations. But I know that's a, a great opportunity there, and Auburn's a great school. I'm just teasing on there. Uh, you know, if you're in this state, you got to choose sides one or the other. I a long time made the other choice, but I'm telling you, I've got a lot of good uh, friends that go to Auburn, and, and, and it's a great school. I know that you will represent us well while you're there and wish you the best in the world out there. Tell me something about uh, some of your highlights of fishing with ASA BFA. Uh, well, actually, today we won the tournament, which was pretty cool. That was a good highlight. Absolutely. You know, nothing wrong with winning tournaments, is it? Uh, Y'all gotten a pretty good uh, uh, history of doing that too. Y'all been fishing and, and fishing well for many, many years. Uh, some great leadership there. Your coach is probably holding you back a little bit this year, maybe. <laughs> uh, Y'all didn't know Curtis Gossett, uh, our MC and uh, director here, is their coach as well. Uh, so I'm just harassed him a little bit. He's a great guy. Um, so. Uh, Tell me about your favorite fishing, whether it's ASA, BFA, or any other thing. What's your favorite fishing story you got for me? Uh, fishing story? Or who you fishing with? Do what now? Or who you like, who, who's your best day of fishing with? Uh, probably fishing with Aaron Martins. I fish with him a lot. I like him. He's pretty cool. Yep. Um, yep. Um, I remember seeing something. You mentioned that on your uh, application in there. Um, you know, got him during his accident too so oh, were you wow okay so yeah uh, great that you are able to spend time with a with a pro out there and and, uh, and getting some influence on that uh, mr smith i know you're gonna go a long way and uh, we just appreciate you god bless you appreciate everything you do for us keep us come back here when you're 21 you're boat captain for us I'd like, like to say thank you to Coach Gossett and Coach Matthews, too, and uh, my parents for letting me be able to do this. Absolutely. Thanks. Thanks. Y'all make it possible for us. Thanks. Mr. Ron Ballman, are you in the house? Come on up. Come on up. Guys, uh, we have, um, we mentioned a lot of times uh, the sponsors that we've got. Uh, this is one of our sponsors. I'm going to go ahead and put this one on. Uh, and uh, Mr. Ron here has been a sponsor with us for a few years in uh, making uh, scholarships possible. Uh, probably not a whole lot of anticipation right now because i got but one left to go. So he's probably know what's fixing to happen. So, uh, Cade Wood, come on up. I'm going to let you present this to him. So, uh, very appreciative, uh, Mr. Ron, here, to, uh, granting this uh, scholarship. Uh, this scholarship is for $1,500, so congratulations, Kate. Uh, I'm going to turn this mic over and let Mr. Ryan talk here a minute, and then I'll come back and tell us something about what you do and give you a chance to talk. Well, we just we appreciate the opportunity to, to partner with the ASA BFA. It's a great organization. Uh, all of the anglers and all of the people that work really hard to make this organization um, run the way that it does, um, just world class, and really glad to be able to uh, present this to Cade this year, and, and congratulations, and, and uh, we expect big things out of you in the future. Great. 
All right, thank you, Mr. Ron. I appreciate you driving over and making this presentation. It means a lot to us all, and uh, thank you so much. You hang around because we want to get some more pictures here. We don't don't take off on. So let me talk to you a little bit, Kate. Um, you know, you were um, you know we we break down our applications, and you were certainly one of our top uh, applicants that we got right there. And uh, you represent real town in in quite a real way. Uh, and you've already got some future plans head out there for your college year. Where are you planning on going? Uh, I plan on going to Faulkner University. Going to Faulkner right there. So um, you're going to be a part of their fishing team? You got plans for that? Uh, yes, sir. I'm, I'm going to be a part of their fishing team. Absolutely great. They've got a, a good team. We've had several of our former members here that fished with us and went on to fish with them. So I'm looking for great things for you there. You represent them well as, as one of our own, I'm sure. So um, tell me about some of your highlights of fishing with ASA BFA. Uh, I think the biggest part in my path through ASA BFA was watching my team grow because my first year on the team was the first year Real Town's team was introduced. And so I've got to see the team go from two boats up to eight or nine boats a year. And it's just amazing just to see how many kids are getting involved in it. Yeah, absolutely. Since you're right there in my neck of the woods, I get to see that. And I've been real impressed with what y'all have done. Y'all have come a long way in just a short period of time. Uh, and and uh, part of their success is in, in part due to you. So I know that uh, they're going to miss you when you move on and head on to Fartnum, but you will be a uh, added asset to them and produce well with them quite uh, in the same way. So you got some folks you want to thank for being a good backer for you? Uh, I'd like to thank just my whole Real Town community for just being here for me whenever I needed them and everything. Uh, I'd like to thank my mom and my dad and my granddaddy Dwight Warren for just being my boat captain for most of my high school career. Thank you. I appreciate you. Um, and, and I can echo from what I've seen in his application. Um, you got a lot of good and positive influence in your life, and that's a good plus there. So congratulations. Thank you, Mr. Ron, for uh, what you do and helping to support these you know, young people like you did this year with Cade and uh, all that you do. We thank you a lot. It means a lot to us. Come on over here and we'll get some more pictures here. That's it for our presentation of our, our scholarships. We uh, appreciate all of the uh, applications that we had, some tremendous applications, and are, are so very impressed with our young people. It's one of the joys I get to, uh, of going through the application and just seeing what fine group of young people we've got. God bless, and thank you all for fishing with ASA BFA and your support.